Proper breathing is really important to treating shoulder and neck pain holistically and making sure that we are addressing all of the factors involved in these abnormal mechanics. So we are going to start laying on our back with diaphragmatic breathing. So your diaphragm is a muscle that actually is underneath the rib cage and it contracts and relax during inhalations and exhalations. So place your hands on your stomach. We're gonna keep the, the knees bent, the feet flat on the floor, just for lower back comfort. And as you inhale, you want to feel your belly press into your hands. And then as you exhale, you want to feel that belly fall. So right now, you are not going to really focus on super deep and long breaths. I just want you to do your normal breath, but just focusing on where you're putting that air deep down into the lungs and feeling your belly expand with each inhale. So you can see here, my belly is going to rise. As I inhale and fall, as I exhale again. Now, big normal breaths, you're going to feel um, the chest and the belly expand, but right now we're just trying to isolate the belly to learn that how to use the diaphragm. Once you get comfortable with using the diaphragm, feeling that belly move, not just expanding the chest, we're going to start to add a four count. So inhale for one, two, three, four. Exhale, let the belly fall, one, two, three, four. Again, inhale, let the belly rise up, one, two, three, four, and exhale for one, two, three, four. A few more breaths, count in your head. Exhale. Inhale. 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 Exhale. All right. That is something that should eventually become very natural where you don't have to think about the belly moving or using